understanding cell range a group of selected cells is called a range the selected cells should be in continuation to form a range when a range is selected in a worksheet a rectangular shape is formed we can use a cell range to perform a calculation on multiple cells the address of a range is created by using the starting and the ending cell addresses separated by a colon sign for example if we have selected the cells from b2 to e3 then the address of the range will be b2 colon e3 naming a cell range excel allows us to assign a name to a cell range this name can be used in place of cell address in formulas perform the following steps to assign a name to a cell range step 1 select the range of cells to which you want to assign a name step 2 click on the formulas tab from the ribbon step 3 click on the define name command under the defined names group the new name dialog box appears step 4 type the name and click on the okay button the assigned name gets appeared in the name box now we can use this name in place of cell address in formulas